What's good, YouTube? Just so far, I'm here. And I'm here at Lowell's, guys. I'm here to pick up some trailers, guys. Or pick up one trailer, guys. I'm trying to get one of these closed trailers, guys. We really need one. If you guys can see the price, can't go bad. Just look at it. From 4,800, guys. 38. So pretty much around four grand taxes in, guys. It's closed trailer. Six by 12, guys. From Lowell's, you guys can't go wrong. Just look at it. Got the LED lighting on it. That's the real thing I was happy about. These are the newer trailers, if you guys can see. Here's the specifications. Payload capacity, the A-frame. The only thing I'm not too happy about is the two-inch A-frame. I really wanted a thicker A-frame, guys. Something like more closer. So, like you guys can see, this one has a dent here. Most likely, this is the cleaner one, but it's the right one here is cleaner. But there are a couple scuffs, so you guys can see. Screws are missing and whatnot. That's how it is. And then here's the main frame itself, guys. You guys can see the front. This one's a little bit, definitely more dirty. This one's been more scuffed up. This one's probably the one we'll probably be getting, guys, right? Yeah, it's nice. This one's more nude and whatnot. So, I'll quickly give you guys a show of the interior. You guys can just come in here and you guys can see they don't want you to really empty the trailer right now and so those are the vents right there so it does have side vents I believe that's one LED light right there you guys can see the spacing on the roof it's not the thickest spacing and whatnot guys you guys can see it's not a V nose as well and it's not also the best side paneling as well if you guys can see and but there is also four corner hooks inside guys if you guys can really see that and there's the back door and I'm in the door right here and just to give overall height if you guys can really see there is a rain guard if you guys are wondering on these trailers to make sure the rain doesn't enter in through the door seals the hinges are imperial hinges and they seem pretty good not much rust you guys can see the caulking and everything it's been definitely sealed and it does say stop do not enter the trailer so so you guys quick interior lock and then the LEDs, you can see the tires, not bad. It's not bad of a trailer, guys, you guys can see. So I'll show you guys a couple quick more walk around and whatnot. Just quick size comparison, if you guys can see that. There's my brother there. These are 6x12 trailers, guys. You can see 6x12 trailer lows. Whatnot. And then 15 inch tires. And yeah, guys, easy hook up to tow. So for me, guys, this is definitely a pretty good trailer to buy it's not too heavy especially with the Hummer only being five cylinders this would be something definitely to grab guys all right guys so we finalized we just purchased purchased this trailer we paid I think four thousand something tax in guys and we're gonna pick up delivery for tomorrow now I just gotta go to the ministry get a transfer to my name and whatnot guys and we get the 6x12 bad boy home guys I love the diamond plate checkered on it the LED lighting the storage guys I know it's not too big of a trailer, I know it's not the biggest badass, but guys, it's more than enough because I don't really got a pickup truck to really pull a big trailer with. This thing should do more than enough, guys. You guys can just see. This thing does a real well job. You guys can see there's caulking and stuff all around it. I'll do a more later walkthrough and I bring it home and whatnot, guys, but general perspective, you guys can see how the tires are. On it. Yeah, guys, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And take care, guys. Next part, I'm gonna show you guys bring this trailer home.